Hi Virgo, this is welcome to my channel. I'm going to take a look at your energy Virgo and then I'll see the energy of your person, whoever it is that you are connecting to and dealing with in love. There is no one like you. Own that. Inspire others to see the beauty in themselves. Giving me nothing but empress. You got a, I'm hearing you got a sweet love. You very sweet. Spirit is saying there is no one like you. Own that and inspire others to see the beauty in themselves. I see you, Empress. Three. So Spirit is, is using you guys. Um, you guys are going to be a guide for others. It's okay to not be okay. The hurt wants to be acknowledged too so that it can be released. So if you guys are feeling, you know, some type of hurt or pain... Feeling like you don't have anyone to run to, anyone to go to, um, go to. Just know that spirit loves you. The universe thinks you're sweet. The universe is so proud of you. The universe wants you to own up to who you are, so you can teach others and inspire others. I'm hearing the universe favors you. Maybe you and somebody didn't have, you know. Um, you didn't have a lot of support. You didn't have, you never had nobody to run to. Yeah, prayer, a lion. Mm. Yeah, you could be seeing 88 a lot. A lot of you guys are very abundant. A lot of you guys are, are walking into a period of your life that you never, ever imagined before. You always dreamed of it. And Spirit wants you to use that strength that you have to help others. I'm hearing you are always being watched by the divine. Spirit is saying, it's no one like you. Oh, that. <laughs> Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit. Straight to the point. Ooh. Spirit is saying, your energy is divine and sacred. Don't allow everyone access to it. Five and two, break it down to a seven. Someone could be very spiritual or realizing, seeing things from a higher perspective. You could be now realizing who you are. Thank you, spirit. You could now be realizing, sun seeds, who you actually are. Maybe you guys looked at a mirror before, but when you look at a mirror now, somebody is owning who they are, how divine they are, how important they are. You see yourself different now. With this five and two breaking down to a seven, it's giving me higher perspective. Like someone um, actually seeing how um, how precious, how divine, how important they are, how much of a privilege it is to be around you or just in your energy. Spirit is saying your energy is divine and sacred. Don't allow everyone access to it. Mm, mm. I'm hearing this is. Is poor spiritual hygiene to allow everyone access to you. Yes. Make sure you guys are saying your affirmations. I'm picking up on healers. A lot of you guys are healers. I'm picking up on your energy. Healers, healers. Speak lovely things to you, to yourself. Spirit said, speak only loving words to yourself about yourself. I'm sorry, speak only loving words to yourself and about yourself. Choose to see the truth in all situations, but speak with love and speak with kindness. I love it. Be very careful what you say to yourself, okay, so see, the subconscious mind don't know. You make sure you speak nothing but loving and kind words over your life. Holy Spirit, give me more messages from my collective sun seeds. It says your body, your body is your temple. Honor it with acts of love, self-care, and healthy foods and activities. And something else. <laughs> Spirit said some of you guys need something. 
So some of you guys could be walking in this year, um, eating better, changing something about your diet. Um, this self care, it self care. Um, a lot of you guys could be learning how to say no. That could be self care for you guys as well. You know, putting yourself first, setting up boundaries. Somebody feels rejected by by someone who's standing in a truth, which is you. Mm. Give me one. Give me some messages. Some messages of the Holy Spirit. Yeah, growth. Somebody grew up. Somebody grew up. You don't see yourself the same way. Somebody realized who they are and how far they came and how important they are. You guys can be teachers. I'm picking up on healers as well. Healers and teachers. Like you guys, um, you help a community of people, everyone around you. Somebody help and heal people just by what they were. Give me more Holy Spirit. Somebody is at peace. And they found that by going within. Because first it started with, with within. Somebody went within. Somebody don't care what nobody got to say. Somebody like, I, I know thyself. I know who I am. I know who I'm a child of. Somebody understanding how important it is. Somebody standing on that throne. Divine feminist, divine masculine. Huh. You know, there's no gender, just, you know, just energy. But I see you. I see you. And don't you come down for nobody. Quit letting people play with you. They know exactly who you are before you even knew who you were. Your divine and sacred spirit is saying, you know how important you are? You're like a celebrity in a spiritual realm. I don't care what you look like on a 3D to these people. <laughs> Beauty, Archangel Jophiel. <laughs> I told you I'm getting Empress vibe, beauty, Archangel Jophia. You guys are very beautiful, very gorgeous. And not just on the outer, the end. Somebody went within. Somebody knew to start their growth, their healing process, they had to work on within themselves. And whatever you, whatever is going on in your body, in your inside, is going to reflect on the outer. Somebody, somebody out here looking real good. Somebody out here looking real good. Looking real scrumptious, sun seeds. <laughs> looking real scrumptious. Okay, so we have forgive and knowledge. I feel like with this knowledge and forgive, um, I feel like it didn't come overnight. I feel like it took it took time. But someone is forgiving others, not holding any grudges. Not giving anyone that much power over their life. Someone is taking their power back. Someone realized the more they 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 hold on to hurt things from their past, it holds them back. Somebody is going forward with this growth card. Yeah, transition. Come through. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Forgiven, not for them, but for you. Somebody's taking their power back. And you know what I'm picking up on intuitively? <sighs> Whoever these individuals are that you know you have to leave, somebody never wanted you to tap into this power because they knew if you did, they already knew who you were. But if they knew you tapped in and you realized it, they'd feel this small. Damn. Here yeah, we got transition. I can't make it up. Release. The past and move forward. What did I just say? I knew it. I felt it. Intuitively. Somebody knew that. 
again release and beginning a new eventual weight a gifts gifts was a problem a lot of gifts something about your intuition you know you know what's here you know what's to come a lot of you guys are high priestesses a lot of you guys are very creative you guys are starting something something real new for you it's going to bring in a lot of stability with these gifts will surprise you you guys are very much protected. I'm hearing somebody made a promise to themselves. Yeah, courage your faith. I can't make it up. Somebody made a promise to themselves. I heard this time around, I'm going to have peace. Mm. I love it, Sun Seas. Let's get some more messages from Spirit. I love it. Queen of Swords with the Six of Cups. I see you guys setting up boundaries, you know? Knowing whatever truth that you know from your past or whatever you could have discovered from since you was a, a very young, you know, a very young child. Somebody realizing like, wow. Whoever I'm speaking of to, these people could have known that you was, you know, someone very gifted since a child. You could have known that you with this Queen of Swords and the Six of Cups. You could just be now tapping in. I can't make it up. Ace of Swords, Spirit said that's the damn truth. Wow. Wow. Ooh, shit. Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit, please. And thank you. I want this energy for my collective sun seeds. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages. Thank you. So the first card out we have is the Queen of Pentacles. What's under the bottom? The Six of Pentacles. So I see you guys could be um, treating yourself out, buying yourself stuff. Somebody also could be wanting to gift you with things with this gift being here with the Queen of Pentacles and Six of Pentacles. Or this could just be the most high and divine gifting you with beautiful things. Oh, you got the Queen of Pentacles with the King of Pentacles. Okay. Somebody um of your vibration or your frequency wants to, you know, somebody who realized your worth, you know, could be wanting to gift you with something, interested in you, want to come towards you. Okay, well, see. Okay. Oh, can you tell me if I'm not going to let this So we have the three of swords here. Okay. Give us the three of swords. Somebody could be, uh, somebody who you released from your past. Could be hurt knowing that you have an offer coming in. The hangman. This is you surrendering from the past and releasing. Give me more Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, high priest. I ain't ever seen nothing like that. Wow, the high priest is fell out on intuition. Wow, high priestess fell out on intuition. You guys are high priestess. You guys surrender to the divine, the most high. Somebody has forgive. Somebody forgave their past. Somebody is a somebody is okay. Okay with with knowing why everything happened the way it happened. Why certain people was put in your life? Why things had to go down the way it did? Mm. It was only to prepare you for this very moment right here. This very moment. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, we have the Knight of Swords. See, the moment you surrender, it's like divine is just like, hey, I got so much gift for you. There's nothing to hold on to anymore. 
forgive, and, and, and you know, something about you, you guys are being, this group of people is being called to teach or be a healer in some sort if you guys are really not in this energy. Spirit needed those people to be in your life to teach you whatever that lesson was. Okay? Whatever that lesson was to make you a better person. To, to do just that. To help and heal the next person. Somebody has a major calling on their life. And it's been like this since they were just child. When we see the Queen of Swords and the Six of Cups in the beginning. Whoever these people is could be very much aware of that. Page of Wands. Knight of Swords was clarified with Page of Wands. Be expecting some good news. It's going to come in quick. I can't make it up. The Chariot. Yo, your life about to take off, baby. Your life is about to take off. Mm. You was disciplined. You was obedient. Somebody understand the assignment. They about to get this. Somebody about to get a victory. Success. Somebody is very much balanced between a feminine and a masculine energy. Two of cups, nine of swords. Somebody else, whoever you release, somebody um, is in their head about you. We have the queen of cups, ace of cups. So you guys definitely um, can have new love here. Or well, this Ace of Cups, Queen of Cups, um, just could be just mean you pour it into yourself. You finally owning up who, to who you are. Somebody is finally realizing that they're chosen. Somebody could have told you this before. Oh, who, me, who, me, who, me, who, me? Oh, I can't be chosen. Oh, I can't. Yes. Now somebody's like, wow. Somebody is used to being around people that put them down. Never make them feel much of nothing. And said, the divine said, come here, 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 come here. Come this way. Let me, let me take you on a ride with this chariot. Let me take you on a ride. Let me take you on a journey with me. Because I guarantee you, the time you come off, come off this journey, I guarantee you, you're going to know exactly who you are. You ain't going to never, ever, ever question yourself again. And, and, and I ain't saying what, 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 what man may say. I'm about to put you in a position where if anybody ever, ever came for you or tried to make you second guess who you are, you will already know thyself. Spirit is saying there is no one like you. Own that. Inspire others to see the beauty in themselves. It was all part of the plan, baby. I know it hurt it. I know sometimes it felt like it was no way out. I know it felt like your back was against the wall. I know sometimes you was in dark places where you wanted to cry. You never wanted to come out of. You just wanted to stay there. Because every time you came out, you felt like it was something after something after something after something. Devon had something bigger for you right waiting. Devon just wanted you to stop running to the same people that hurt you. Release them. Choose you. Get these people out of your energy. It's poor spiritual hygiene to have these people around you. Listen to what Spirit says you are. Spirit says your energy, you, you right there. Your energy is divine and sacred. Don't allow everyone access to it. You're highly favored. And that's this high priestess falling out into what should you know that you know that a lot of you guys because you know spend a lot of time by yourself yeah the full card seven of wands this is you being divinely protected on whatever this new beginning is for you a lot of protection Two of Pentacles. You could be going back and forth in your head. Don't fumble this opportunity. 
you ask for it, don't fumble it. I'm hearing like whatever you do is divinely protected. Whatever you do is going to be abundant. You just got to make the first step. Ten of cups. Whatever you do, you're going to be happy. Whatever you do, that is the judgment. Whatever you do. Whatever investments that you make into yourself. I see you guys um could be uh with the page of swords and seven of pentacles. You could be looking into um, you know, different things that you want to start, different projects. Yeah, look at this, ace of wands. Different projects where you want to invest your you know, your um your time, your energy, your finances into. A lot of you guys are um looking up things, studying things. A lot of you guys got a lot of options. But you guys are considering something that's gonna be real made. Whatever that is. Whatever you've been thinking about investing in. It's going to take off, okay? The universe is here in your favor. Give me a card on the um, Two of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Two of Pentacles. This is that what I'm telling you. Don't, what did I say? Don't fumble this. Whoever I'm speaking to, you, Mystic Sunflower will, will come where you listen to me. Don't make me find you. <laughs> Trust these. Don't fumble this. Being in your head with fear. With this new opportunity that you got, you about to take off. And you with the seven of wands, the fool, you, you are protected. Ten of cups, you're going to be happy. That's the judgment. Three of Wands, I'm telling you. Three of Wands, Ten of Swords. Release whatever that is. People, places, things. It could be an old mindset. Or somebody could be, you know, whoever these people that betrayed you with the Ten of Swords, Three of Wands. You could be scared to turn your back on these people that hurt you. Somebody, somebody is about to be like, ah, ah, yeah. Three of Cups, Wheel of Fortune. They, they try to get you to, you know, take you to the promised land celebration. You could be scared to leave these people behind. Will of Fortune and Knight of Cups. Mm -mm, don't fumble with. Here go fear. The man downstairs. Creeping up on somebody. Uh-uh. Don't reflect on about what happened in the past. You can't change it. It happened. You released it. And that's what I see here. Give me a card on the three and swords, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you, three and swords, Holy Spirit. Be expecting good news. Something that you've been waiting on. It's about to make you real happy. Okay, three of swords was clarified with the two of swords. So there could have been some type of heartbreak from, because we seen the six of cups and the queen of swords earlier. I'm sorry, the six of cups. And the Queen of Swords, yeah, earlier when I cracked the deck. So some something that could have hurted you with the Ten of Swords and Three of Wands, something that could have hurt you from your past could have been holding you up. Get out your head about it and forgive them so you can move on. Whoever this person that, that, that hurt you, they was blocking something from you anyway. Four of Pentacles. I'm seeing you holding back. You holding back and choosing you. Give me a card on the Four of Pentacles, Soul Spirit. Yeah. Five of Cups with the Ten of Pentacles. A lot of you guys, um, a lot of you guys going to be holding back from family. Yeah, with the Ten of Pentacles with these. Look, but it ain't nothing but rats and mouses all around your, your abundance. So you need the who you got around. Yeah, like these people only with you for what you got anyway. I'm just being honest. It ain't nothing but rats and mouses all around your abundance. Yeah, justice in the star card. Something is about to be made fair. Something is about to be made fair. And I see you walking away. Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Capricorn. Cancer Pisces. I'm sorry, um Taurus Virgo, Capricorn, K 
cancer here. Yeah. Aries. Pisces. Pisces. Scorpio with this judgment. I mean, that's some of the signs. Yeah, something about your past. Six of Cups. Yeah, Six of Cups with the death card. Something is over. These people are going to come back and apologize. But Spirit has said, with, this, with these bounces and these red bodies, Ten of Pentacles, Spirit said, I showed you who they were. Don't you forget that. I showed you who, I, who they were. That's why Spirit is saying, your energy is divine and sacred. Don't allow everyone access to it. People are going to try to come back because they see you in this star-like energy as well. That's all. Be mindful, Sunseeds. The lovers and the Nine of Cups. Somebody sees you as wish fulfillment. Somebody sees you as complete wish fulfillment. Five of Swords. Somebody just don't know what to do. This person could be half going crazy, losing their mind. Somebody also could be feeling betrayed by you for turning your back, for choosing you. Somebody could be feeling betrayed because you chose you this time. All right, Spirit, clarify the Five of Swords. Wheel of Fortune with the Ace of Cups. Wow. Somebody going to watch you. Be happy. Get everything that you deserve because you dealt with so much injustice in your past. But it was all with purpose. But now the divine want to make things fit in this lifetime. Gifts will surprise you. New beginning. Spirit want to do something for you in this lifetime. Somebody, and I've been picking this up, but I haven't been mentioning it. And I know I need to say it. Somebody is about to experience a certain life of good karma because of what they did in their past life. I don't care how what people thought of you, how they perceive you, what the hell they said, that's their business. God judge you by your heart. God know who you truly are. Somebody is about to reap good karma with the Wheel of Fortune and the Ace of Cups in this lifetime because of what they did in the past life. And these people, some of these people are going to feel like it's not fair that you get this. Mm, 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 mm. Three of Cups, I'm telling you. Page of Swords, and they're they going to watch you celebrate. Seven of Pentacles, because you decided to work hard on yourself. And, 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 and then whatever you invested in, and I, and I feel like that was just you with that growth card, working on yourself. You chose you. Ace of Swords, Spirit said that's the damn truth. What the Empress? I can't make it up. Five of Wands, leaving the conflict, the drama. Bunch of chaos. People putting you in competition. Jealousy. These same people that was fighting with you, they fighting each other. Queen of Swords, that's the damn truth. Ooh. Give me a call on the Five of Wands. Ace of Wands. After all the drama and the problems, Five of Wands will clear out with the Ace of Wands. You get a whole new passion in the beginning. I'm telling you. Queen of Wands, Four of Cups, Nine of Swords, Nine of Wands. I feel like you learned a lot of le lessons. And now someone knows how to protect their energy. It might be moments sometimes you do get in this energy of, of fear of fear it's okay to not be okay you're not going to be okay every day just make sure you don't stay there acknowledge whatever that is and move on acknowledge it receive whatever knowledge you learn from it and take it on the next chapter in your life. Six of Swords under the bottom. With the Nine of Pentacles. 
one pinnacle away from ten of pinnacles, and we seen the ten of pinnacles out here already. But you had rats and rats and that damn thing around it. Eight of swords, you no longer bonded the tower. People losing their damn mind. People losing their mind by you choosing and loving on yourself. Whatever this new opportunity is, is for you, you got people all in their feelings. God dang it. People stress the heck out about your new beginning. Wow. Shrift card and the sun card with the two of cups, eight of cups. Wow. Somebody stressed out about shrift card and the sun. This is this give me nothing but self love. You got the star out here too. You being happy, fulfilled. Look how you look. Beautiful. A Leo could be some nigga fit. Aries Tower, um, Scorpio here, Two of Cups, with the Eight of Cups, a lot of you guys, this is new love here, for others of you guys, this is just a new love that you found for yourself, a lot of you guys are in relationships, partnership with the Most High, the Divine, co-creating the life that you envision, is here, I'm here with whatever you want, you can have it, Seven of Cups, Temperance, I'm hearing you're going to keep rising. Somebody's going to keep rising to the top. Seven of Cups, the Temperance. Mm. See someone who's very patient. They waited for this opportunity. They waited for this time. You're going to have a lot of options. Seven of Cups with the Eight of Pentacles. A lot of, you know, a lot of people are going to be wanting to work with you, collab with you. A lot of people, you're going to meet people of your frequency now, of your vibration. It's just going to, oh, man, I'm excited for you. <laughs> King of Wands, you're doing, you, you're, you're attracting a, a lot of, a lot of leaders like yourself. Four of Wands, I see your stability doing very much well. For a lot of you guys, um, you're going to be getting proposed to or married in this lifetime as well. Ooh, the moon card and the eight of wands. Something is hidden from you at a distance. Six of wands with the world card. Somebody might be world now, known all across the world with that star card. Cause you know what? Wow, spirit. You know whatever happens in the three. Everything happens in a three D. Everything happens in a 3D before it... Uh, I'm sorry. Everything happens in a 5D before it hit the 3D. And I did just say earlier, somebody could be like a celebrity in the spiritual realm. And now it's about to manifest on a 3. Wow. I know that's right, Sunsees. Wow. <laughs> wow. Somebody... Somebody light about to take the hell off. Congratulations. A lot of you guys could be singers or dancers, or that's something that you love to do. Wow. Give me some mess more messages, Spirit, before we close this out. For my beautiful collective sunsees, please and thank you. Holy Spirit, give me some messages from my beautiful collective sunsees. Ooh, that's a lot, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. Wow, Sunseeds. I'm telling you, somebody is about to be very... Mm. And I understand that everybody doesn't want to be well-known. Everybody doesn't want to be famous. And that's okay. But whoever you are, you can't hide. You can't hide. Somebody is made to shine. I'm hearing you've been hiding long enough. Somebody was not born to, somebody was born to be seen in the spotlight. You could have dimmed that to make others feel secure. But Spirit is saying, no. 
make sure choose positive thoughts to describe your home career finances as your words determine your outcome this is someone that's speaking beautiful affirmations over their life the laws of attraction somebody somebody understood the assignment like i said earlier okay <laughs> heart chakra Your parents could have had a heart chakra awakening. If you get nervous, focus on service, workshops, and seminars. Somebody is supposed to be on some type of stage teaching and healing people. Something that involved your throat chakra. It's supposed to be speaking. Okay? Giving speeches. I'm talking about to big audience. Somebody is a teacher. It says workshops and seminars. Attending and giving speeches to attending and giving speeches is part of your spiritual path and purpose. Be open to teaching and learning. Yes, crown chakra. Intuitively, a lot of you guys know that. Spirit is saying, listen to your feelings, emotional sensitivity. A lot of you guys are earth angels, very chosen, indigos. You a lot of you guys are very that's why spirit is saying your energy is divine and sacred. Don't allow everyone access to it. It's because a lot of you guys are very much aware how, how sensitive you are towards energies. And we have past life issues. A lot of these people from your past, it, they make you feel very, you know, uncomfortable. You're, you're like, you're, you're, um, you're very sensitive. You know, your energy just, it don't really, it, it don't really rock with them. Your soul don't. It, it just it just bothers you. You're real sensitive towards it. And you feel it. You feel it. You know it. For a lot of you guys, you could be avoiding people, places, and things because you know how sensitive you are to these energies. But Spirit is saying, be willing to forgive. Make sure you forgive in your heart. You got to forgive. You got to forgive. A lot of times, you'll be surprised, I see and I'm not taking off of nobody, son. See, you know I got your back. But a lot of time, you'll be surprised. People don't even know how. They, 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 didn't, they didn't even know how to love you. Precipitate your energy. Some of these people ain't never seen nothing like it. You have to forgive them, son. See, not for them, but for you. That shit, that, that, mm, mm That shit, mm, mm that, you coming out as an empress and, and we see beauty, Archangel Joe, I know you gorgeous. I know you, I know you ain't harping on to none of that. Because true beauty relies in your heart. With this heart chakra, it's in your heart. You can't help but be loving. You can't, you, you teach people. You come to this earth to teach people what love is. Be willing to forgive and throw shock. I told you, it's something about, about you speaking in books. A lot of you guys could be, um, be authors or could it be writing a book that's going to help so many people. Healers with addictions, you are profoundly clairvoyant in crystals. I feel like you guys are healing from situations that you, you you felt like you was codependent on that once upon a time because you felt like by walking away and choosing you, you was going to let people down. Some of you guys thought it was... You felt bad for being selfish. You felt bad for release. Releasing people. Mm. I'm hearing somebody saying, this time, I, I swear I'm through. I'm choosing me. And look what's happening for you. Look what's happening for you. There's no one like you, Spirit is saying. Archangel Raphael and Fairies. You got that angelic vibe, that angelic energy. Anything else, Spirit, before we close this out? A lot of you guys stayed in situations where people and places and things because you had a lot of love, you know? And, and, and that, that that emotion, that love, which is the emotion, it had you th had you acting out and doing things that you wouldn't even possibly think you would have done because you had so much love. 
but it's time to release. Something beautiful awaits. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Okay. A vacuum away sin. I told you. What did I tell you that thing was down? What I told that man downstairs was. When that two of pinnacle, I said somebody better not fumble it. Vacuum away fear. And yes, said the master is not playing. They not. Yes, said the masters, powerful, loving, and wise spiritual teachers are watching over you and guiding you. For some of you guys, you got ancestors that was um doing this in their um in their past life. Our Angel Michael is here protecting you, okay? It is safe for you to be powerful. It is safe for you to take charge of your life. It is safe for you to take your power back. It is safe for you to call the shots. It is safe for you to speak what you want over your life. It's your life. Okay? I love you, Empress. You know, it's just energy. Anyone can embody it. But this is what's coming out. And to my, 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 my empresses and my divine masculines, this is a beautiful energy. And if it's, it's only up, and if you know if it's up, then it's stuck. 